morning on June the 4th here. Today we're reading about Jesus cleansing the temple, the story recorded in the Gospel of John. This is an interesting debate when it comes to trying to figure out how John's events line up with Matthew, Mark, and Luke. Matthew, Mark, and Luke all say that Jesus cleansed the temple right before the crucifixion, at the end of his ministry. John has it right after his first miracle, the beginning of his ministry. And so we're trying to figure out when did it really happen. And I think the best solution is that he did it twice. He did it at the beginning of his ministry and at the end of his ministry. If you look at all the details in the Gospel of John, they're different details than the other Gospels. With one exception, the table got turned over. Other than that, the stories are not really the same story. So most likely, he did it two times. And the debate about that, though, seems to draw our attention away from the main point, which is he was zealous for the temple of God. And the disciples recognized that. This first confrontation with the Pharisees is also recorded here. And I think that's the bigger point. His first confrontation with the Pharisees, they were all in favor of the temple, talking about how long it took to build it and, and how beautiful it was. And Jesus' response is, it's no big, I've seen better course he's come from heaven of course he's seen better and he said i'm going to tear down this temple and rebuild it in three days not 46 years those three days of course he was talking about his own body well they realized that later he was talking about his body so the main point of this whole story is that jesus is to be the new center of worship okay just like the wedding in Cana showed that Jesus knew is going to replace the ritualistic old. The temple period was passing away because the new center of worship, the new center of religion is Jesus himself. Be blessed.